And we have some other happy wanders I'm about to introduce here. Happy wanders in the sense that they've been touring all over the American League cities and the National League cities. In this issue of Look Magazine, Look assembled about 463 baseball broadcasters from all over the country, all the big league cities, to pick an all-American, all-star team of the big leagues. And we're about to present it here on our stage. Here is the 1955 edition. And we're going to call them out here one by one. Duke Snyder of the Dodgers. Roy Campanella of the Dodgers. Don Newcomb of the Dodgers. Willie Mays of the Giants. What did you hit today? <laughs> you just hit one. Now, how many does that give us all together? 51 homers, as you all know. Early win, the great Cleveland pitcher. Robin Roberts of the Phillies. Mickey Vernon of the Washington Senators. Now representing the New York Yankees, who are had a little trouble getting out of the fact the Dodgers. We're delighted that you guys got here. We didn't know whether they'd be in from Pittsburgh or not. We missed some of the Yankees, but accepting the awards for Yogi Berra and Mickey Mantle, Del Webb, co-owner of the Yankees with Dan Thompson. Now, ladies and gentlemen, here are some of the stars on this look all-star all-American team. Plane schedules, train schedules, rains, and thunderstorms prevented some of the others from arriving here. But I'd suggest you baseball fans to get this because I say here's the selections of 463 baseball broadcasters. These are some of them. So they go off. Art Hannes is going to present them these magnificent watches, these specially made Elgin watches with the little cross baseball bats and gloves on the face of them. But now as they go off, this look all-star team of 1955, how about a very great hand for a bunch of fine athletes who give America nothing but great pleasure.